Hello friends, welcome to this video of Coordinate Geometry. In the previous video, we studied about the facts related to the Cartesian system. Today we will solve some questions based on the same. Let's take first question. In which quadrant are the given coordinate points located? In such questions, pay attention only to the signs. We don't have to state the exact position of the points but only in which quadrant they are. The sign of the first option reflects the third quadrant, minus minus. That is, this point is located in the third quadrant. Similarly, the second and third option will be in the second and fourth quadrants respectively. Can you tell the position of the fourth coordinate point? If we see this point in xy plane, its x coordinate is 5 and y coordinate is 0. This point is not in any quadrant but on the positive side of the x axis at 5 units. You should remember that if any of the coordinates in the coordinate point is 0, then that point is located on the axis. If the x coordinate is 0, then the point lies on the y axis. And if the y coordinate is 0, then the point lies on the x axis. So if both x and y coordinates are 0, then on which axis will that point lie? Friends, this is the origin which is at the center of the xy plane. Let us see the next question and answer the questions asked by looking at the graph. Let's take the first sub-question. 1. Write the coordinates of the point A. To write the coordinates, we draw perpendicular lines from the given point to the x and y axis and points where the lines intersect the x and the y axis will be the x and y coordinates respectively. Drawing perpendicular lines from the point intersects the x-axis at 2 and the y-axis at 5. The coordinates of the point A are 2 and 5. Second sub-question. 2. Find the distance of point B from the y-axis. Just as we got the coordinates for the first sub-question, we will find the coordinates for the second sub-question as well. And they will be 3, 0. You can see that this point is located 3 units away from the origin. That is, the distance of this point from the y-axis will be 3 units. Now the third sub-question. 3. Find the distance of the point P from the x-axis. We will also plot it in the same way and we can see that it is located 4 units away from the x-axis. Now let's take the fourth sub-question. 4. Find the y-coordinate of the point Q. This is a simple question. If we have to find the y-coordinate, we will draw a line parallel to the x-axis from this point, which will intersect the y-axis at minus 5. So the y-coordinate of the point Q is minus 5. Let us now take the last question of this session. 5. Find the distance of the point R from the X and Y axis. Solve this question yourself and find the answer. So friends, that's all in this video. In this video, we solved some questions related to the Cartesian system. See you in the next video with some more interesting questions. Thank you.